Good afternoon, good evening, good morning, good late night to all of you, wherever it may be. It is the Retro YouTube once again, giving you guys today's Moo Day game tutorial on Discord. And tonight, we got for you guys Moo Day Keys. For you guys, Moo Day Keys is a system in Moo Day game and Moo Day bot where you can unlock keys for your characters and become your soulmate. We'll talk about that in just a moment. So keys allow you to unlock your waifus or hasbandos potential in the game and you get bonuses for that. But to understand how it works, we need to run dollar sign info keys. Now have a look at this screen. So every time you run dollar sign info keys, this will pop up. We're going to go through it step by step, however, okay? So, this is going to affect all the characters that you already own, okay? Keep in mind, own characters only. Not wish list, unfortunately. So anybody in the wish list will not count toward this system. Keep that in mind, okay? So let's go ahead and on my server, that is my server, Let's go ahead and see who I have. Dollar sign MM. So anybody in this list, including page two, by the way, which I did get page two, has a potential to get keys. If somebody rolls a character in my claim area, then that character gets a key. Okay? We'll talk about the the commands in just a moment, okay? There is, there is no level cap in terms of keys. But some of the bonuses you could include, you could get, include, include the following. You can change the embed color at level 1. You can add bonus Kakara value at level 2. And at level 10, you get half the power of the, of the Kakara play. So if you react to a Kakero stone, instead of 100% power, you're going to operate at 50% instead of 100%. So that means you could actually get use the Kakero stone at least once or twice per, per claim period, okay? Now, now remember that it only goes to the characters that you already claimed. No wish list is allowed in this case, okay? Now what happens if you roll your character and you and you alone roll your character 10 times during the game? That character becomes a soulmate, okay? You know when they say in love, I, I have a soulmate. In that case, that is exactly what it sounds like. You have a soulmate and in this game, your soulmate is how many is the character that you roll more than 10 times, okay? So keep that in mind. I do apologize for the noise outside. Um, washing machine is going wild right now. Yeah, that wa washing machine became a waifu. Anyway, so make sure you understand that. And we'll talk about the commands in just a moment. To check if you have a soulmate or a key, make sure you check out a few things. You can check out profile if it wants to play with me that is. There it is. And you can see that in my case I have zero. Zero keys. No keys for me. Okay? But in some cases we have character players who have keys. So they're the lucky ones. I'm not. Because I just claim whoever, whoever's cute. That's why. But anyway, if I had keys, it would be in display on my profile by now. Okay? You can also check dollar sign MMYD. My Mary YD. And as you can unfortunately see, I have zero. No result. Okay? Now, let's check out dollar sign SL. 
I also have a zero because I don't have a soulmate. Okay. Now, let's say you did have keys, however. I would like to go over some commands. Dollar sign Y. Actually, dollar sign something with the letter Y will allow you to filter out keys and sort your keys if you like. So let's say MMY, my Mary with the keys attribute. Unfortunately, because I don't have a key, I get zero. Okay? If I just do dollar sign MM, I'll have something because I do have I do have characters, okay? Now let's say you want to see the ladder. We're gonna go we're gonna go TSY. Dollar sign TSY. And in my case, in our server right now, my server, take a look at all these keys that we have here. Somebody has three keys, has a lot of keys here. Somebody has a lot of keys. And I have zero. Okay, I have zip right now. Look at all these keys and I get none of them. How nice. Anyway, so that's for our server, okay? You can also do TSYB to see the best character and the best player. In my server though, TS, TSYB includes the following. The top 10 or a few here. Look at these guys. These guys are just going for it at, th at this time. Excellent. My server is good. Except my player, me, uh-uh. Okay, <laughs> so let's see what happens there. Okay, I don't play as much because, of course, I do my other projects, but we'll see. Now, here are some things to understand. Oh, and also, if you want to know the global, the global aspect, T-S-Y-T. Okay, T-S-Y-T. Actually, it's for total. Look at this guy with 63 keys. Can't even beat him. Uh-uh. So those are our total keys right now. And it's hard to grab a key, unfortunately. Okay? Now, if you want to see the soulmate commands, dollar sign S space soulmate. Please do not use dollar sign S for soulmate because dollar sign S is actually for search in regular movie game. Okay, so make sure you put dollar sign S space soulmate S O U L M A T E. Okay, and these are the soulmate commands. Basically, dollar sign S something is with the letter S. Okay. So basically, your regular Moody game, but for soulmates. And I do want to draw your attention to a rule here that I do want to understand. I do want you guys to understand. If you guys use a dollar sign MK to roll, that automatically gives you a character somebody roll already. Here's the problem. You can get the you can get the Kakara from the character, but the owner will not receive a key for that. That's most likely because dollar sign MK always rolls up a character that somebody already rolled. So this only applies to dollar sign W. Dollar sign um excuse me, dollar sign H. Dollar sign H G. Basically, anything that you roll or other players roll will count toward your keys, and dollar sign MK will not count. And this is to make sure you don't cheat, because dollar sign MK only rolls characters already claimed. So 
Let's see if I run it right now. Dollar sign MK. I got this character. Okay, you see? It's because it's already belonging to somebody, that automatically means it's claimable. Okay? That's already claimed. So you cannot get you cannot get um, a key by this play. This player cannot get a key, okay? So keep that in mind. Alright? Other rules to understand. If I trade if a character with a soul key with a key, regular key has been traded, given away, or this or divorced via commands like like divorce, like Thanos. Thanos all or all those moderation commands that deliver a the delivery divorce. They cannot be affected by perks for three hours. Keep that in mind. Also, also make sure make sure that when you use these commands, you have to use them properly. If you want to disable the key system, dollar sign toggle keys. I'm not gonna do it here because there's a lot of players that are playing right now. Okay? So I'm not gonna do it here for that sake. Alright. But that's it for the Mude key system, everybody. If you guys enjoyed this, feel free to leave a like, subscribe, and enjoy. And make sure you guys check out these other Moody tutorials I've done. In our next tutorial, I'm going to actually break down how to play into separate mini tutorials to understand new players, okay? That's all for now. We'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.